hi everyone welcome back to my channel i want to welcome all my subscribers back to my channel and if you're not yet a subscriber please go ahead and click that subscribe button down below and remember guys to click your notification bell so you don't miss any new uploads okay um so tonight before i start i want to say thank you to all those who entered the giveaway uh so tonight two lucky persons will win for themselves a vision board kit courtesy of journey with me kc all right um thank you for all of you guys who participated for all of you who shared my video for all of you who tagged your friends you know just to share the word because i mean everybody i think everybody should um start on the path to um achieving their goals in 2020 2021 so i'm excited i'm really excited to see you who will win for themselves a vision board kit um so now that i've gotten that out of the way i'm going to jump right into our topic for this video so in this video i'll be sharing with you guys five things that I do to position myself to generate wealth. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm when you're feeling down and your mind is under pressure don't you worry cause i know it will get better so speak life and it will turn out in your favor just wanna let you know that this will make you stronger you know see the house yet claim it if you know see the money yet claim it if you know see the land yet claim it if you know see the job yet claim it if you know see promotion yet if you know see the business yet if you don't see the guy, yeah. if you don't see the hey. So the first thing I do to gener to position myself to generate wealth is actually to make a plan. And I did this plan in 2019, which was last year, February, when I did my vision board. So in making a plan, you can use a vision board or you can simply just write down on a list, write down on a piece of paper or make a list of the things that you plan on wanting to achieve for the upcoming year or two to two years three years up to five years whichever period you want to do it for so um the person who wins this vision board kit or the persons who win their own vision board kit tonight will be in a good spot to start planning um how they will position themselves to generate wealth in 2020 2021 so the next thing I do is I make a budget. So every month, guys, literally every month, I create a budget. I have a budget template that I created and it's on my online learning center. I'm going to put the link down below to the online learning center so you guys can go on and sign up and register and do that course. It's actually a course. Um, the cost for the courses on my channel are from, some of them on there are free, um, but this particular course is at a cost of $500. I really do not plan on going any higher for my courses. So it's a place where you guys can go and to develop your skills. If you're not good at computing, if you're not good at IT, it's a place for you to go. Um, yeah, and check it out. So please go and sign up. The course that the that the budgeting is available in is actually basic excel under the topic of templates so it actually shows you how to create templates actually shows you how to use existing templates in microsoft excel and it also shows you how to create a budget i actually went and i created a budget template and it's on the in that course so it's free and you can download it okay all right, so moving on. So you can create a budget. That's the next thing that I do. I create a budget literally every month and I put all my expenses in there, all my income, all my savings, all my loans, etc. I put it all in there. And what it does is that it automatically, once you put in the figure, it automatically generates um, the amount that you have left. It automatically calculates um, after you have paid 
one of your expenses they tell you how much left for you to pay etc it's it's a it's a compact kind of budget um so you can go and check it out i'll put the link down below for you to do that so that's the next thing i do i do a budget um one of the things with budgeting guys is that when you have expenses what you want to do is that you want to um bring your expenses down to a limit you know um when you want you want to spend less and save more that's the essence so when you put your budget together you look and see how many expenses you have for um, for the month or if you get paid um um bi-weekly you can look at that and see how many expenses you have and the whole idea um in putting yourself in a position to generate wealth is to look at all your expenses and try to cut your expenses in half literally in half so if you see that you have um 10 expenses um you want to see if you can cut it down a little bit so and i mean you don't need to do it all at once but gradually just try and cut them down gradually um so you can save more not so you can spend more but so you can save more and that's the other one that we're going to go into but before we go into that um still on the topic of um budgeting you want to look at your expenses and see what you can cut one of the things i try to do is i try to look at my expenses and see the stuff that I don't really need to do because remember you want to look at your needs and not your wants some things on your budgeting list and or on your expenses are actually wants and not needs so if you realize that it's something that you want and not really what you need i guess you need to cut it um sometimes as i said you know i've said it before that i try to praise myself or celebrate myself um at least once a month you know so you can put something in your budget for that um, but you don't want to create a whole big thing I mean you can celebrate yourself taking yourself to a restaurant buying a, 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 a small meal sometimes in generating wealth or putting yourself in a position to generate wealth you have to live within your means sometimes live try to live below your means because sometimes you really don't need to do all the stuff that we're doing and we don't need to spend all the money that we're spending um try to limit the amount of times you eat out um and all of that i'm still trying to work on that because i really eat out a lot i really don't cook a lot not because i don't want to well yes i don't want to because i'm tired but yes in a sense that's something i'm working on um yeah so moving on to the other one the third thing that i do to position myself to generate wealth is to save so i try to do a lot of savings sometimes it's not good to you know um spread yourself wide but i some of the stuff that I do to save is I go in a partner plan. Um, don't go in a partner plan where you're spending money that you know you won't be able to afford to pay monthly or bi-weekly or weekly. Go in a partner plan that you know you will be able to manage. You have partner plans with people. I go in a partner plan with a friend. But you also have partner plans with credit unions. You can go in your partner plan with a credit union if you're a part of a credit union. I think banks have it too. I'm a part of a credit union. So I did my partner plan with my credit union as well at one point um another thing you can do is one of the things that i do is i create a standing order so each time i get my pay my um salary department will actually send over like um a two thousand dollars to one of my bank accounts that i have absolutely no access to i deliberately did not take any card for my from my credit union i deliberately did not take any card from one of my banks because i wanted to not um we call that word now i did not want to tip i don't want to tempt myself to go and pull money so when my salary department sends over the money to there it stays there unless i really need it and i feel like i need to go to the bank and i'm not a bank person i don't go into the bank at all unless it's absolutely necessary and 99 percent of the time it's not necessary so the money stays there so that's one of the things you want to do if you have three bank accounts 
give them back two of the cards and keep only one um so yes that's my suggestion when you when your salary comes you can set up a standing order with the bank so when your money comes in your main bank account the bank itself can send over money to your other bank accounts so that's another option if your salary department don't allow doesn't allow um them sending money to other accounts for you that is um so yeah that's one thing that i do that i suggest that you can do as well um what else do i do hmm yes one other thing that i do to save is um i have an insurance where there's a part on it where i can save i think they call it an investment or whatever but that's a way i can save as well so i don't really touch that unless i have emergencies where i need to take out a little funds from it which is not very often probably twice a year um and i try not to touch it a lot because at the end of the day we're trying to save money um I also have to stay for my son so that's another additional expense um the that was the third thing the fourth thing that i do to position myself to generate wealth is to invest um currently or i know previously um the government has been coming out with a lot of ipos and businesses have been come businesses have been coming out with a lot of ipos um the first IPO that came out was the Wig Wignan or Wig Wignton. I don't even know how to pronounce it. The Wignan Farms one. Um, I didn't get to go on it, but I heard that it was a good investment. But it missed me because at the time I did not know what um the whole Wig Wig Wignan Farms. I can't pronounce it to save my life. I didn't know what it was all about, and by the time I got the information about about it, um, it was it already it was already gone. So. I made up my mind that the next IPO that came out would not miss me and it did not miss me at all. Sure, I did invest in Trans Jamaica. Um, so I guess my suggestion to you guys is to find out about IPOs because there are a lot of other, there there are a lot of other IPOs that I see coming out. Um, so you guys can talk to your banking institution about it to see if um, they can give you information on investments. Um, I think Sagicore has investments as well. So if you're a part of Sagicore, you could talk to them about investments. Um, yeah, and the, the whole issue of invest, investments, I know some persons um, try to um the, a lot of persons don't trust it or because they don't know they don't know if they should do it my advice to you guys is to get as much information as possible because some of these investments you don't know if it's gonna go north or if it's gonna go south all right so get as much information as possible about these investments the fifth and final thing that i do to position myself to generate wealth is to educate myself and i suggest that you guys do this as well i suggest that you guys research ask questions call companies ask them a lot of questions so you understand exactly what you're getting yourself into call and find out so you can know what are the investment options what are the savings options what are available to you um, to help you to generate wealth and generate additional income in talking about additional income this is a bonus for you guys i suggest to you guys as well that you guys think of a way or think of a business that you can start right now is the best time to start a business and there are a lot of things that you guys can do to generate well to generate additional income in terms of starting a business uh, a lot of persons are doing online business right now and i think it's a booming business i think um just do the research um google i know there's a site that i use um and by using that site i was able to secure or not even say secure i'm to this day working with an individual that is located in the united states and she pays me online so i suggest that you guys um 
uh, research and find out what are the available options for online work. Um, the site that I met her on was Fiverr, F-I-V-E-R-R. -R. You guys can check it out. I think that's how it's spelled. I don't even remember because I don't really use it anymore because she um, kind of pulled me off full time. So, um, yeah. Uh, so yeah, start a business. I, there are a lot of things that you guys can do. Think of an idea. I mean, anything that comes in your head that you think can you can be able to market to generate income. It's it's possible. Um, a lot of persons are doing art pieces and selling them. A lot of persons are creating products and selling them. A lot of persons are doing a lot of things. Um, persons are doing hair. Persons are selling services, massage services. I mean, there's literally no limit on what you can do to generate income. If it's an idea in, in your head, it can it can generate income for you so i suggest you guys think of and i mean think out the box um i wouldn't say um don't do this or don't do that as long as there's an idea and you're passionate about what it is that you want to do i would say go for it if it's a book you want to write and sell go for it if you want to sew and sell things go for it if you want to um write pieces for people go for it i mean literally anything you think of that can generate wealth it actually can generate wealth so i suggest you guys look into starting business so remember that guys 2020 2021 2022 these are the years to start achieving your goals and these are some of the things that i do to position myself because right now i'm still in the positioning phase um to generate wealth and generate more income because one job can't cut it and we all know that um the liquor 95 salary really can't go nowhere because the expenses are so tall and our income is like so the expense i'm here and the income is like this so we're trying to grow our income to match our expenses um so yeah so i'm just gonna go over them the first thing that i do is the plan and when i say plan i created my vision board you guys can do that or do anything else that you think um, um you can do to plan um the next thing that i do is i make a budget and as i said my budgeting template is available on my online learning center i'm gonna put the link down below so that you guys can access that and the budgeting template is available under the course basic microsoft excel under the topic of um templates the cost for it is 500 Jamaican dollars. Um, the instructions is there if you want to do that course. I think it's very cheap. Um, so you guys can go and check it out. The third thing that I do is I save. Um, so as I said, there are a lot of ways that I can save, that you can save actually. And there's a lot of ways that I do to ensure that I save. I do standing order. Um, I do savings with my insurance. I even have a piggy bank. I didn't even mention that. I have a piggy bank that every day we come home, we drop our coins in there. So you can also think, I know people who only save $20. I know people who only save $50. And by the end of the month or two, three months, they have like 10 10 thousand 15 thousand at the end of the day when you do that you just go and drop it in your bank account so that's another thing that i forgot to mention so um and the fourth thing that i do is i invest um for me i invested in the trans jamaica highway but you guys can also find out from your banks or your credit unions if there are any other investment options that you guys can jump on um the fifth thing I suggest that you guys is to educate yourselves on all of the above. Educate yourself on how you can plan, how you can budget, how you can save every investment options that are available. And I also suggest um, <clears throat> as a bonus that you guys start your own business. Find a way to create income, additional income for yourself. All right. So I hope you guys learned something today. And I hope that I will see you guys putting these things into action. Um, if you guys want to talk to me, I'm going to put my, you can, you guys can actually inbox me on my Instagram. You guys can DM me on my Instagram or inbox me on Facebook, whichever one. Um, uh, or you can leave a comment down below for me to reach out to you and I will try and reach out to you guys. Um, 
so yeah thank you so much for watching this video as you guys can hear i'm a little hoarse seems like i'm coming down with the flu i hope it's not coronavirus because i'm trying my very best to keep safe and sanitized so pray for me guys um yeah so thank you guys for stopping by to all my new subscribers welcome to the family thank you for joining with me and i hope to join with you as well we're gonna go right into picking our winners for our two vision board kits and i'm so excited i'm going to put it up on the screen right now so guys before i spin the wheel i want you guys to know that if it is that you guys commented on both my instagram and on my youtube channel under the video and if it is that you win on instagram i'm going to remove your name from the list on youtube and if you if you win on youtube i'm going to re remove your name from the list on instagram all right so that we can give somebody else a chance to win of course so let's get spinning who is gonna win mommy and sage life you are a winner on youtube thank you for commenting underneath my youtube account and i hope that we can get together and start creating our vision board so congrats again mommy and sage life yay so let's see who is going to be our winner for the instagram giveaway let's go guys Andreen McKenzie, you are a winner on Instagram. Congrats, Andreen McKenzie. Please contact me down below, guys, with your information. Or rather, please inbox me or DM me on Instagram your information so we can get together so you can collect your prize. Congrats again, guys. Thank you all for entering. I'm so excited for my winners. I'm so happy for you guys. Congratulations on winning your vision board kits. As soon as you guys receive your kits and create your vision board, I want you to send me a picture of it. If you're going to put it on your Instagram, please tag me so I see the vision board that you have created. And if you need help in planning and um putting things into place achieving your goals you know you guys can always reach out to me for those of you who did not win but entered i want to thank you guys so much for entering and don't be discouraged um i have vision board kits on sale i'm going to drop the link down below to where you can place your orders as well and i'm gonna make them very cheap you guys because at the end of the day I want you guys to be able to afford to create your vision board so that we can start achieving our goals together because it's a journey. We want to achieve goals for the next year and the year after that and the year after that. All right, so we want to see we want to see each other achieving our goals. So don't be discouraged. And at the end of the day, I'll always be having more giveaways on my YouTube channel. So keep on journeying with me while I journey with you and we achieve goals together. Yay! All right, so remember guys to click that like button because I want to see you guys clicking the like button Remember to subscribe if you have not yet subscribed and click your notification bell So you don't miss any new uploads from me. All right guys. Thank you so much I remember to share it with your friends um, If you know anybody that wants to start achieving goals in 2020 2021 2022 go ahead and share it with them and it's my pleasure to be sharing this information with you guys. All right, thank you guys. Bye. When lessons over me, lessons will run over. When lessons over me, lessons will run over. Double the ocean, double money, double the care, double the family. When lessons over me, lessons will. Run